Hey guys, welcome back to the channel Opinions Matter. This is your host Das and today we got a brand new drone uh, to unbox. So yeah, so we went and bought a Mavic Pro instead of buying a Mavic uh, Air. We returned our Mavic Air just because our Mavic Air was having a lot of transmission loss. So we'll go quickly and unbox this stuff for you. Okay, so out of the box, this is what you guys are getting. So you get the very heavy Mavic uh, Pro. Uh, I mean, like it's really heavy. It's compared to my Mavic Air and then you'll have a controller uh the controller actually has uh, a usb usb one and it has a usb uh, i think a micro usb the good thing about the mavic pro is that it actually can toggle the camera and you can control the gimbal and the pitch so it's a three axis at three angles that's a very very good thing with the pro we didn't know about that though inside the box you'll find another uh, otg cable um, a charging one you get a micro USB to USB, some stuff, and uh, well, manuals, they're always important, and your charger. That's pretty much it. I would actually recommend you guys to buy uh, two more extra batteries for your air, so your total flight time can be one hour and 15 minutes. Apart from that, I also recommend you guys to buy an extra set of propellers, because accidents will happen, and you need those extra propellers. We're going to open this Mavic Pro up, and we are going to show you uh, what are the steps that you need to follow before you get into the air uh, so at first you take off this small tiny uh, cover which is on top of your uh, protector or a gimbal protector and then the second thing is that you have to remove this gimbal protector uh, this gimbal protector can get scratched up very easily just because uh, it is made up of clear plastic so that's the reason then there is this rubber thing that protects the clear protector and if you see carefully there is another small gimbal lock out here. This is very important. Do not lose this and do not misplace this because otherwise you will have to buy third party ones which are like another, uh, you know, 10 bucks or depending which country you are living in. It, these are very hard to replace. So uh, gently, very gently and very carefully you are going to move this cover. And that's how the cover looks. That's a clear plastic cover. Now the gimbal is ready to go uh, to unpack this at first you move your uh, back legs to the front like this and then you turn it's kind of hard to hold uh, turn like this okay turn your uh, the, the back ones like this and there you go that's how it looks uh, and after that before you also fly make sure uh, you have uh, your wings spread up a bit not that it does matter but uh, the spring should be uh, uh, the wing should be spread out a bit also on the side as you can see out here when you pop this thing up uh, there is a small port where you can pop in an SD card and that's how you connect to your remote controller and if you're flying it from your phone doing gestures which are now available for Mavic Pro you toggle this to Wi-Fi that is a reset button we'll cover this separately on uh, our third video because it's kind of tricky. Thanks to uh, Anton from Tech5, he actually told me that reset button because it took me 45 minutes to figure out how to, uh, you know, connect this to the controller. Okay, guys, this is how the remote controller looks. So out of the box, you'll find a OTG cable. So good thing, uh, like the Mavic Air, the Pro also comes with a built-in OTG cable. And you have a USB port. Now you can add an additional or secondary controller through this USB port for cinematic purposes. Why? Because watch this. When I turn this around, you will see there are two control sticks out here and out here. So this one control your gimbal's movement and this this one out here it controls your iso levels so sorry shutter speed levels so you can control your shutter speed and see what's exposure you're getting there are also two other buttons which are located at the back out here and out here these two buttons can be custom buttons i have set one for iso i have set the other one uh two histograms so that i can get the histogram pop up very fast and uh two joysticks uh unfortunately like the mavic air these joysticks they don't come apart so they are fixed so you have to think about that uh, now when you look into the controller carefully you will see that uh, it shows GPS signal out here it shows the battery of your drone and it shows the transmitter signal out here on this side is uh, how, uh, how what is the status of your motors how fast the motors are spinning and this is how fast you are going 
because the Mavic Pro actually has got uh, bottom sensors and they have sensors that can scan for, for water levels and everything so they're like sonar sensors and it shows you clearance out here this button uh, is to uh, pause or stop the drone whenever you want this button is a digital zoom button so when you press this if you are in 1080p mode you can actually digitally zoom everything and stuff like that so is the Mavic Pro worth it? in 2018 should you get the mavic pro or the mavic pro platinum for 999 i think it's worth every penny but guess what as of today in united states right now you can go to amazon.com and buy this stuff for 787 dollars 99 how about that right 200 bucks off than the regular price 4k camera shoots at 30 fps you got sensors at the bottom that can intelligently analyze water levels and everything. Then you have got sensors on the front for uh, obstacle avoidance. Two great new motors which is updated from the Mavic Air and this phenomenal new controller. This controller that gives you status and everything is phenomenal. This thing, I will also tell you one more thing, is that this guy can fly up to, up to, 6.5 kilometers without any transmission loss any transmission loss i mean like we were flying we are flying in a complete legal zone we had a lot of grounds to cover but this guy just kept on flying and we flew in a legal space a first time for 6.5 kilometers yes this is definitely worth each and every penny for 787 cannot beat that price so thank you guys if you are watching and uh, getting entertained in this channel give me a big big thumbs up uh, do subscribe to my channel for more news support my channel because my channel doesn't get paid it's totally unpaid unsponsored by anybody i buy all the stuff myself and share it with you guys so take care Yo, how did the drone saving go? Mission success.